This video is brought to you by buyptcgocodes.com. It's a great source to buy all your codes to play the Pokemon trading card game online. As you can see, they have a large variety of codes at reasonable prices, and they provide instant email delivery on purchase. If you make a purchase, if you use the code CABIGON5, you'll receive 5% off your order. Check them out and let them know I sent you. What is up everybody? Hungry Cabagon here. I have got some packs today. Uh, actually, a few sets have been reprinted and they're back in stock again. So, I could only get 10 of each set, but I, I got 10. Uh, so we got 10 Space Juggler, Ooh, which is a little bit... Uh, uh, it's been around a little bit recently, but it's kind of hard to get. We got the... Uh, what is it? Silver Lance and then the Jet Black Poltergeist. I can't remember what it's called. Geist in, in Japanese. So we got 10 of each. Uh, now, these two sets especially, we're basically looking for SRs because all the regular cards, even like the Calyrex VMAX and stuff like that, they've been reprinted. It's not really like super hard to get them or anything like that. So ideally, we want to get SRs if possible. That's what we're looking for. I know that's greedy. We're kind of taking a gamble to get it, but there is some crazy <laughs> good cards we can potentially get. So let's try and get uh, one of them. So... We've got a box in air quotes box because yeah obviously it's three different sets but it's a box worth so let's open uh, this way see what we can get hopefully get some good luck let's go it's been a little while since we've opened these ones uh, since kind of the sets came out really and uh, these ones for better or for worse, I had to choose my own packs, so I've got uh, completely random packs. So, let's see what that does for us. Hopefully, it is uh, treating us well today. Alright, we got a very gross, slimy, slow king. Cool artwork, but yeah, it's pretty gross. <laughs> I dig it though. It's got some ooze coming out of the side of his head. Alright, pack number two. So yes, we would love to get a special art. They are quite hard to get and quite desirable, so... Okay, that's not a bad trainer to get. So the, um... The Jet Black is the set that everybody wants, so that's a lot harder to get compared to the... At this side of the set, the Silver Lance. So this, that's the one we want to have the good luck. Huh, weird. Same trainer card twice already. But yes, that's the side we want to have the good luck. So we will take the good luck in that one, please. If we don't get anything of this, that's okay. We're getting lots of trainers. All right, we've got something in this pack. Sandaconda, hmm. That is a card. Hey, he's not terrible. We do have the nice special art version, which was a promo for... I remember which side of the... must be this side of the set, because it's in this side. And there was the Celebi promo as well. But that Sandaconda one is super cheap for a nice special art promo. Uh, it, it is quite cheap. Like, under $10. Gosh, these packs don't open very well. These new ones. Yeah, so that's um, that's kind of cool artwork on that one. What is this? Ooh, all right, we got the Calyrex. Now can we get it in a special art, please? That would be amazing. Those, this is probably the best we're going to do out of just regular cards. Non-SR cards. But that's still a good card. Not gonna knock getting that. Okay, you go there. Old Canyon with a sick artwork. So the, the pulls are coming out. We chose good packs, but as always, we'd trade it all for a nice SR if we could. But who knows, we might still get one. Still plenty of time. I mean, I know we don't guarantee, but obviously we would like to get at least one. 
just because we do have a box worth of packs, but it doesn't always go that way, <laughs> that's for sure. We could get three or we could get zero. And uh, typically for me, it seems to be zero. So we would like to change that if possible. But the pull rate is good so far. Okay, in this one. Yeah, getting lots of double ups of the trainer cards, which is interesting. When they have all these packs laid out as well, I don't know, it could be more than one box worth, like shuffled in there. So, I don't know if we can expect to get like a typical box worth out of our pools. And so many supporters, which is unusual out of this many packs. Getting a ton, our last one. Something. All right, we got both the VMAXs out of that box. I mean, we got a good number of hits. It's a good omen. So four hits out of our 10 packs, including one hollow as well. All right, let's go Space Juggler. Irida, that's who we want to see. Irida and Palkia, please. If you could oblige me, please set, that would be nice. Okay, nothing in the first one. Even the um, Irida hollow is quite expensive three or four dollars, which is pretty expensive for just a trainer card. So we wouldn't mind to see her, that would be good. Voltorb, not Voltorb, or Beetle. I knew it had Orb in the name. Yeah. Okay, anything in this one? Did we pick good ones this time, or did we pick duds? I don't know. <laughs> this is the problem with the random. I mean, packs are always random, but these are especially random, because I literally just picked, like, one from here, one from here, one from here. It's all totally random. Ooh, okay, we got a V. Not the, uh, the best artwork, I have to say. I don't know. The other ones we got are very nice. They're all nice looking ones, but yeah, that cleavor is it's a bit average, that one. Definitely could have done better with that one. Okay, let's go, come on. It's a bit slow compared to the first one. Okay, Sino Temple. See a glimpse of something shiny. Yes, all right, that is good. That's the best thing we got so far. Hopefully that is a good omen for things to come. Yeah. All right, so yeah, we're a bit slower on this set, Red Rock. So yeah, we got a lot less hits this time. As always, we just need one nice one. We got the glasses. So tick. All right, come on, last two packs, let's go. As always with a lot of these sets, like you're really kind of gambling to get that nice SR pull. And if you don't, yeah, you're kind of not probably going to get your money's worth. So you need something out of these last few packs. Let's go. Come on. Oh, oh, we might have something in this pack. Oh, all right, Sinnoh Temple Gold card. I 
No, we don't have this. We pulled a different gold stadium. Sick. Looks nice. We take it. So one SR down. Excellent. On the last pack. So the pull rate was very different in that one. Um, let's hope that that's a good omen for the last side of the set, though. Not the last side of this. That set. Last side of... Yeah, you know what I mean. Come on. Got something in here. Ooh. It's a Metagross, which does look sick. I do like this artwork. Getting some VMAXs, that is for sure. Three VMAXs already. Alright, come on. I'd say that this set will be very hard to come across. It will not be easy to find this, so... Kind of thought I would get some while I had the chance. But there's... Uh, who's the good... Full art trainer in this one as well? Caitlin is like really expensive. So we would also take that. We got spiral energy. Okay. We're on the home stretch, but I'm hoping that there's still something good to come out of this. But we got our one SR card at least, so we'll take that. That's very nice. Okay, I can see something in the back of this pack. Oops. Down there. Is. <laughs> it's a fat squirrel. That hollow edge still gets me. It's still misleading after all this time. Looks kind of like it could be a HR card. But definitely getting the the double ups of the trainer cards, which is is kind of unusual out of this number of packs, but it's it is Completely randomized packs, obviously. Okay. We got something. Something in this pack. <sighs> again, see? That edge. <laughs> it's the same. It's the same guy again. Alright, come on. Four more packs to go. Go, let's go. Go look. Three more packs to go. Right, I'm just trying to think how we're going hit wise if we bought a whole box. Pretty decent. What the? The third one of her. Yeah, I mean, I think we got. Yeah, about a box worth. Maybe less hollows, but that's fine. We don't care about that. But these ones are not giving us too much lucky energy. It's coming down to the last pack. We started out very strong, but obviously it's... Can't always <laughs> keep up that pace. Okay, last pack. I can see we got something back there, but I think it's just a hollow. Is there going to be another squirrel? It's a Gengar. I can see the edge is a bit damaged. So that one was... Yeah, we got four hits in the first ten packs. And then we got <laughs> only three hits in the last twenty packs. So that's interesting ratio. But I think we did alright. We got the, the gold card, so we can't complain with that. Hmm... Yeah, it was, it was okay. We can't complain. We got basically a box worth of stuff. Maybe missing like a couple of hollows and um, maybe missing one V. Mm. But it's pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It's only thirteen out of thirty had something in there. So that's not ideal odds. But yeah, we'd probably only get like one extra V. So yeah. For a box worth, I'd say that's pretty good. Anyway, let me know what you think, guys. We'll see if we can get some more random sets, but I don't know how easy these ones we to get, but I'll keep my eye open. Let me know what you think anyway. 
Uh, check out the channel for more videos. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Take it easy.